again, and we're going to be doing some backyard stories. We got eight backyard stories, so yeah, let's get started. So, this story is called Among Us, and so, our neighbors, which I'll make up a name for, Elijah is a boy, by the way, and Tom. Tom is in the store. I'm just putting that out there. So, yeah. They have this, like, porch thing I'm going to do to you. Um, that. Big black chairs. We would sit in them and watch Elijah play Among Us. That's it. <laughs> So that was like a day-to-day -day thing. So yeah. The next one is called Killer. And I know that sounds weird, but I'll call this friend of mine a uh, Minnie. That's not her real name though. But anyway, Minnie, we were doing like a tracker thing and Elijah thought he had a cool thing. Oh, and Tom was there too, but I think, I don't remember. But we saw like a white van and, and he made up a strange thing that if he we saw a white van with a knife in it that it was a killer and it kidnapped a um, mini. It was the strangest thing. I think it was like a, predict, a prediction nap or something. It was really weird, you know? So yeah. And then we, we we have to go in for dinner, so end of story, end of discussion. No longer interesting. Anyway, yelling. So you know what I said about Minnie? Well, she was like close to us, like a neighborish thing. Like a close, but not too close. You could walk to her. But we would like to yell to see if she would come down there. And once we did, I don't remember if it was with a different character, our new neighbor that we have now, or Tom and Elijah. So, yeah, I don't know. But we would yell, and then, then once they came down here and we all played baseball. This is, these were kind of short stories, so, yeah. Toys. Everybody loves them. So, we had this thing where we were like, if, if, if we can't go inside Elijah and Tom's house, then we can just bring their toys outside. So, I remember my tricycle had, it was a Batman one, and it must have like a little pocket. Because I remember we would pack my little thing as much as we could, and we would all get our hands full with it, except for me, because I had to steer and we would go down and and my nana came out and caught me on my tricycle riding down and we ha and it was kind of fun bringing all the toys on there but she was like get back all those toys up back there and it hurt so much just going up it with lots of toys the only time i went up was with nothing in there so yeah it hurt <laughs> but i had to do it too so haha -ha. Don't leave. And I know I said they're our new neighbors, so you might know about us. Don't leave is a kind of funny story, but Eli Elijah, Elijah, and us were like we were all friends, including Tom. So we, it was kind of sad because they had to move to. I'm not telling you, but anyway, they had to move, it was kind of sad. So one of our close to last days of them being there, when he didn't have to go pack, we, they had like a wooden playground area, and we thought it would be cool if we colored all over it, so the people who would move here, which litter a lot, wouldn't want to move here. Because they were like, oh, some kids drew all over the playground with chalk. So we got up there and started chalking the whole thing. And we even wrote our names on it, and it's still there. Man, we really miss them. 
So yeah. So sad. So when they left, our new neighbors, which I'm gonna make up a new name for, Kevin. <laughs> yeah, Kevin. So yeah. So one day when our new neighbors came out, it looked like a little boy, like a little little boy. But then the next day, there was like a kid my sister's age, one year older than me and one year younger than her. That was named Kevin. Yeah, that's the made up name though. So yeah. And we didn't know what happened. I think the little boy was just looking. I don't know because, you know, it was kind of what? Huh? Anyway, I think the little boy was just looking. And you might be saying, what if Kevin had a younger brother? But we asked him, and he was he didn't have a younger brother or sister or anything. But anyway, Kevin's our friend now. <laughs> yeah. But anyway, we have our next story, our seventh story after this one more story, called Rain. So... I don't know, remember when was, when was this, like, with Elijah and Tom still there? I don't know. But anyway, we would like to play when it was raining with, like, umbrellas. And after it stopped raining, we would, like, sing. We would sing in the rain, and it would be really weird. Okay. For our last story. Anyway. So this story, it was, like, everybody... Eliza and Tom were still here, and you might be like, why didn't you say that story for first or something? But I wanted to save it for last because it was my favorite. So some other kids that were close, but it wasn't Murphy. Well, Murphy probably came, I don't remember. Oh, no. So yeah, so these two other kids came. And we all had like a big party. Well, thank you for com coming, and I might, and I'm gonna go show you where all of this happened. By the way, if you heard me say Murphy, that was just another kid. No, it's not her real name, by the way. Our backyard. Where all of the magic happened. <coughs> yeah. That's the whole playground we could look out. This is where the magic happens. So yeah. Thank you for coming on my journey with me. Oh. Backyard stories. Oh yeah.